All right, we're gonna brush out early morning matted tangles. Um, and we're just gonna show you how easy it is using your favorite brush and tangle gripper. The really unique thing about tangle gripper is it's gripping tracks. It's made of a special rubber that locks the hair into place and it doesn't slip out of the grip. That's what makes it so unique. You can hold the hair really close to the scalp with just two fingers. This would be your other option and you can't really get a strong grip. So a lot of parents suffer with the pulling because the tangles are from the bottom all the way up to the root and I'll show you how to use it so it makes it easy for you. So we're gonna start from the bottom of the head and work our way up just so you get nice clean sections. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to use it if you have tangles that are from the bottom all the way up to the root. So you just start from the bottom, you take a section and you grip so I'm gonna rope, I'm just gonna flick my wrist up so that allows me to push the tangle gripper against the scalp. And you just press and hold and brush, okay? So these tangles aren't bad at the bottom, but it's just to show you how to use it if you do have tangles that are really bad in this section. So I'm just gonna fl uh, flip my wrist, push it against the scalp, squeeze, and brush. That's it, okay? So we're gonna do the next section. It's very simple. This is on dry hair, which is really awesome. Um, it works amazing on wet hair. If, I, if you have really severe tangles, I recommend washing the hair using a conditioner and then grabbing your, your favorite brush and a tangle gripper. So we're just gonna continue to start from the bottom and work our way towards the head. Squeeze and brush. That's it. Okay. Just keep taking manageable sections. You don't want the section to be wider than Tangle Gripper because then it won't lock any hair into place. So squeeze and brush and work your way towards the head. And that's it. See? And this is on dry hair. Come over. Okay, so you can hold it here like this, or you can rotate your wrist and hold it like that, whatever is more comfortable. I like to just keep it more natural on the near the bottom. So you come from the bottom, you work your way up. I'm just gonna rotate my wrist now because it allows me to push it against the scalp. That's it. Look at that, tangle's gone. And this works on every type of hair texture. Any severity of tangles. If you have, if you don't really have really bad tangles, but you have such a sensitive scalp, this is great for that too. But if you really have bad tangles and none of those detangling brushes work, grab one of these. It doesn't hurt to try it. We guarantee it. If not, your money, you get your money back. So you have nothing to lose. Okay, so we'll just keep going. You can literally comb out your kid's hair in half the time, especially when you start really getting used to it. It's not that hard. So another way you can do is you can just comb until all the tangles bunch up and you just place tangle gripper above it. That's if you don't have tangles that are from the bottom all the way up. So you just start from the bottom until those tangles bunch up. That whenever that stops, place it above the tangles and brush. A lot of people are like, oh, you don't comb the hair from the top. You always start at the bottom, yes. But you're really not, all you're doing is just bunching those tangles up. You're not stressing the hair out. Um, and then once you get those tangles, you place it above it and then you start from the bottom work your way, it's the same thing, okay? Just allows you to hold the hair. So same thing here, we're just gonna comb until those tangles bunch up, place it ab above and brush, okay? There's a good knot in there. Okay, look at that, gone. All the hair, look at that. All the hair is tangle free, okay? I know those detangling brushes, they. A lot of them just glide over the knots, so you're can, you keep brushing over them and they don't get taken out. And then when you comb the hair, you can still get the pulling and tugging. This allows you to take all the tangles out because you can use a stiffer bristle too if you need to. Okay, so last section. I'm just gonna comb until those tangles bunch up, place it above, start from the bottom, work your way up the head. Okay, here's one there. That's it. And it, it's so, the effort of holding it is so much better than trying to hold the hair aggressively. Because eventually if you have to do the whole head, you might, your hand might start to get sore. 
that's it so you're just brushing those tangles are bunching up there you're just placing it above and then you're starting from the bottom working your way up and then whatever you get snags always place it above until those tangles are gone just gonna come over here that's it okay tangles bunched up that's it and elia did highlights with this blue so when you do the highlights too it really makes the hair um it just damages the hair so it gets tangled easier also okay so you just grip and brush and that's it all that hair is tangle free thanks for watching